Over the weekend, local activists rallied at the state capitol for more protections and hazard pay for farm workers. Cap KVU's Drew Miller heard their side. On August 19th, Governor Inslee issued a proclamation requiring agricultural employers to regularly test their workforce for COVID-19. Other health requirements are providing employees with masks and hand-washing stations. On top of that, there are two funds to help workers during the pandemic, the Immigrant Relief Fund and Food Production Paid Leave Program. Farmer advocates say these things are temporary fixes to a larger issue. Agricultural workers are the backbone of this country, and we are being treated as disposable people. Brian Vasquez has traveled around the state advocating for farmers. He says a letter for the governor is being drafted, demanding hazard pay and a livable wage for farmers. They deserve the hazard pay. And if, if they don't do it, who else is going to do it? Third-generation farmer Keen Christensen says it's expensive to run a farm. Employers are often going into debt to stay relevant, and the market dictates the price of crops. He says our area has such an abundance of food, he makes more money exporting it out of the United States. Domestic prices of food, he claims, are the worst, and people are not buying as much as they used to. The, the reality of paying people more than what you can is, is just not possible. I mean, it's not a perfect world that we live in. You know, our margins are so slim on most agricultural commodities that we, we can't even pay what we would like to pay somebody just because that's not the reality that we live in.